Hey everybody, welcome back. I am so excited. Today, I've got a treat for you. We're going to tour the Cedar City Golf Course. Welcome back. Thanks for joining me. I am Jenny Hendricks. I am so excited because look who I have on today. Hey, Jenny, how are you? <laughs> I have Jared Barnes, who is the director of golf of Cedar City. He is at Cedar Ridge Golf Course, and I am thrilled. Thank you so much for taking you time to talk to us out. today. Jared is a dear friend, and he's especially a dear friend because he owes me one more golf lesson. That's right, that's right. We gotta get that swing straightened out. <laughs> that's that right, <laughs> we do. So tell us a little bit about the Cedar City Golf Course. What do we need to know? Yeah, no, you know, it's a great spot. 18 holes, um, the original nine, kind of behind us here was built back in the 60s. Wow. Uh, the back nine was built in the early 90s and um, very busy municipal golf course, city owned, um, just a, a great recreational opportunity for the community. And, yeah. And uh, it's just a great spot to be. Now this is the only golf course in Cedar City. This is, yes is. And yeah, it is the city owned golf course. Only golf course in town and uh, yeah, it's, it's gets busier and busier. It does. Uh, it yeah. has been getting busier. Yeah. And I will tell you, it is an absolutely beautiful course. You will be surprised when you get onto the front nine on the back side and then on the back nine, kind of on the northeast side, the red rocks, the scenery is absolutely beautiful. It's really a great place to play it, golf. It really is. Yeah, it's a, it's a great uh, backdrop, right? And our superintendent, Steve Carter, just does a great job keeping the golf course in, in great condition. He has really had a challenge over the years. <laughs> he has, yeah. He, uh, he you know, we battled uh, some prairie dog yes. issues uh, back in the day, and um, he worked with multiple uh, government agencies and we were able to get it all taken care of and it's, it's made a huge difference. A huge difference. Yeah. Like say prairie dogs around here and see what kind of reaction you get. Right. And then the water system was just updated. Correct. Yeah, we just redid the whole, um, well, the front nine and number 10 water system put in a new irrigation pond and uh, it's been great. It's it's uh, better coverage, but it's also better water conservation. That's great. That's great. And I will tell you that for being this early in the season, this course is beautiful. Yeah, yeah. It's, this is really it's looking starting, good. starting to wake up. I mean, there was up. snow on the ground a week ago. There was. There was. <laughs> That's yeah. crazy. That's yeah. crazy. Okay, so the Cedar City Golf Course is a par 73. Uh, we just, it has been, but it's going to 72 with the new. Oh, with all new, of the, the new, new housing development going in. in. Okay, yeah. okay. So number 12 is becoming a par four. Okay, so. so then you got, okay, so it's a par 72 with four par fives. Right. Okay. Three sets of tees for golfers of all different playing Absolutely. abilities, according Absolutely. to the website. And we don't call them, we don't call the red tees the women's tees, right? We right. call them the forward tees. It's any, all kinds of uh, uh, playing abilities can play from, you know. I think that's a great way to do it because it just, there are some people who, whether it's age or sure. ability or whatever it is, some people just can't hit the ball as far. Right. And so you're going off of distance, not play from the gender tea. or anything like that. Play from the great. tee that, that allows you to have the most fun. That's what it's I all love about, that. Right? I love so. that. Okay, I'm still playing from the reds. That's all right. So <laughs> I may join you pretty soon. So. <laughs> okay. Now, Cedar Ridge Golf Course is home to the Southern Utah University men's and women's yes. golf teams. Cedar High and Canyon View High yeah. golf teams. Yeah, we get quite busy in the afternoon. In fact, uh, you can see, I don't know if you can, but that's some of the SUU men's oh, team right on. out okay. there practicing right now. Fantastic. The, the uh, women's team is away at their conference championship. Right oh, now, so. awesome. Yeah. That's great. That's so. great. And I know there's a lot of charity tournaments that yep. go on. Yep. Our first one next month is the Rotary event. Okay. And I uh, was just on the phone actually with them a few minutes ago. But okay. we do probably a dozen charitable events. That's so great. That is so great. The thing I love about those charity events is all that money stays in the community. Exactly. You know, it's, it's all for local local charities and it's so it's a it's a great it's thing. a really cool thing and I sit on a couple of boards for the organizations that do the charities here and they raise tens of thousands is, of dollars yeah. it is it is a huge deal for these local organizations that benefit the community really so that's is. very cool yeah. very cool yeah. okay now do I need a tea time if I want to play at the Cedar City Golf Course no in fact we don't take them okay so, uh, we're just a walk on golf course however the next uh, four or five months I always tell people we keep our calendar updated 
um, it's always good to just check and make sure we don't have an event or a league or something like that. Right, because you're starting to kind of get into your busy season right. where there are some of those things so that there are, are... Yeah, there are days the course is shut down because we have an event, so it's always great to check. Okay, now if I need some practice, which if we're being honest, I do. <laughs> So I don't feel like I want to go out and just play 18 holes. What are my options sure. here? Sure. Yeah, we've got the driving range um, right out here. It's a, a great driving range. So you come into the golf shop, buy some tokens. We've got a ball machine to get your range balls. Um, we've got a chipping putting green uh -huh. both here as well as down by number nine tee box. Okay. And a great short game area. And yeah, plenty of opportunity. We've also got three instructors that give lessons, myself and two of my coworkers. And... Uh, Love to help you work on your game. Yeah, thank you, because I need you to help That's me work right. on my. I really do. And if you if you are interested, the instructors here are really good. Um, they took me like from zero to maybe five. There I'm not. Go. I'm not to a ten. Maybe a five. But we can only do so much. <laughs> you're no, not no, wrong. Just... You're not wrong. <laughs> this is what you have to work with. I'm sorry. It is what it is. Okay. Now I have been told that there is a really fun, exciting new thing coming. Yeah. What is that? Yeah, it's really exciting. So it's a cooperation between the city and the university. Okay. And they're building a, a learning center. It's going to be over on the range T. Um, and the city donated the property. The university is uh, raising the money. Awesome. And it's going to be just a great practice facility for the university teams. Um, we're going to be able to use it for those charitable events. Okay. We'll be able to use the banquet space to go down and eat, eat lunch afterwards and do the scoring. And uh, yeah, we're hopeful uh, 2023. We see okay. that uh, okay. start being built. Fantastic. So. You know, that is one of the things that I just love about the community in general is there's such a great partnership between the city and the community and the university and, and things like, you know, the university and the city working together to put yeah. a great facility at the golf course. It's just, it's just cool, it is. you know, it really it's just is. cool. It's a, it's a good partnership. What else do we need to know about Cedar Ridge Golf Course? Uh, let's see. So we've got great men's and women's leagues. Uh -huh. So love okay. to have anyone who's interested in that. Um, starting in May from 11 to 3, we cook the best burger in town. Wow, so come okay. So burger. Okay. Um, yeah, you know, it's just a great place to great place to be. Awesome. So. Okay. Well, if we finish this video quick enough, I'm going to go grab a bucket of balls. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for joining us today. And Jared, thanks for having time to hang out with us and explain about this really, really great facility. I'm so excited. Come on down to Cedar Ridge Golf Course in Cedar City. I am Jenny Hendricks. We'll see you soon.